Welcome back. We are taking time this February to honor black history and today we are sharing a story of a young girl with an extraordinary talent. Okay, I can't wait for this one. 10 year old Victory Brinker is already making her mark in history. Alyssa Royster with our sister station in Pennsylvania has the story. Hi, I'm Victory. At first glance, Victory Brinker looks like her average 10 year old. For example, she loves playing with her dog Gus. Hanging out with her siblings. I have 10 brothers and sisters. And as for what she wants to be when she grows up. Hmm. A singer. Can you, can you sing? Yes. How good? Mm, pretty good. Yeah, she's definitely being modest. has taken her all across the U.S. and even outside of it. I've gone to Paris, gone to Milan, Italy. Her pipes would even land her on the stage of America's Got Talent, where she'd sing in front of the one and only Simon Cowell. Everyone says like he's tough or mean, but I like Simon. And Simon liked Victory, so much so that not only did she get four yeses from the judges, but the golden buzzer. It felt great. The confetti was really pretty, and I was like grabbing handfuls and stuffing it in mom's purse. Mom Christine, AKA Victory's momager, says Victory was born with it. She was singing little nursery rhymes at 18 months, and she was on pitch. Morning, noon, and night, mom says Victory can be heard singing. Victory sometimes sings in her sleep. Yes, we try to figure out what song is she singing in there. Her siblings agree that their sister sings. Good. Good. Though when asked if it can get a little annoying. Sometimes. Sometimes. She, she, sings, she sings a lot. But they did find a fix for it, telling Victory to sing to her stuffed animals instead. So I did making the perfect audience, her teddies could never compare to her biggest audience yet. It was 67,000 at a Steelers game. You'd think she'd be nervous, but instead, Victory says she felt one, happy, and two, freezing. I had to wear like four coats, a big hat, lots of socks, and lots of pants too. Accomplishment after accomplishment, Victory thought she had done it all. That is until the Guinness World Records contacted us asking if Victory would be interested in breaking the world record for the youngest opera singer. She sang on the show not knowing that she was going there to, to receive a Guinness World Record. She had no idea. We kept it as a surprise. I feel great because I didn't really know a lot about the Guinness World Record. And who could blame her? I mean, she did qualify at the young age of seven years old and 314 days. If that wasn't impressive enough, Victory can hit over three octaves as well as sing in eight different languages. English, of course, Latin, French, Italian, German, Spanish, Korean, and Ukrainian. With the sky as her limit, Victory says at the end of the day, she has one simple goal. I want to inspire others to follow their dreams. Reporting for WTAJ News, I'm Alyssa Royster.